Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I'm John. This is Betty, a true nerd, and welcome back to The Witcher, where finally the town has opened up to me and told me where I can find the Salamanders. Salamandra. They're both called the Salamanders and the Salamandra. It's kind of confusing, but also kind of cool. And now, finally, the Reverend has said, speak to Olaf. He will give me the key to an old abandoned house where the Scalamandra are hanging out. But I have got all of my abilities nice and set up at this point. I've got a really, really quite powerful, stunning force push thing that I really like. I think with that, we've got this. Oh, but first, we've got a bit of a crowd going on here. Ah, troublemakers. Right, you guys need to be taught a lesson then. Got it. No, leave me alone. Ooh, little dove, cue us a different tune. <laughs> Keep your hands off me! She is feisty. Say, let's do what we did unto Mickle's girl, Ilsa. What a screamer. <clears throat> you knew too? He likely told you to wait like us. Let's have our way with this little chicky. It so happens that this lady is with me. None of you will touch her. So you say? We aim to have our fun and you won't stop us. Is that so? Alright, let's just go for these guys nice and quickly. Go into this pose. So, go, go, go. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. I My new little thing works pretty nicely against all of you. Screw you all. That worked pretty bloody well. I love group so much. Group is great. Finish him off. There we are. Saved you. Geralt, you arrived just in time. Are you alright? I am now. They surprised me. All the peasants ran out and I was trapped. They killed the innkeeper. That's the last time they hurt anyone. That was some swift sword work. As for me, I'm done delaying. I need to get to Vizima. I hope to see you there. Let me walk you to the gate. These roads can be dangerous. No, you need to deal with the salamanders. Don't worry about me. I'll wait for you here. Make them suffer, Geralt. For me. I'll come back for you, Shani. I'll be waiting. The innkeeper. I should check his pockets. How exactly is Shani able to go to Vizima? Like, she's not important. Why would she have a pass? And there's the key in question. Marvellous. Now, just need to clear out the salamander's hideout. And make sure we grab all of the chicken and ham sandwiches off these guys. And there it is down there on the path back over to where the Reverend is. Alright, nice and simple. Now, let's just very quickly, I think I've got a level to do here. So everyone else has already run off because of the trouble, including all of the guards, you big damn heroes. Let's just light this thing with my I fire powers. I, I can light it. Look how I've got fire powers. Check out my fire powers. Do you remember you've got fire powers? You've had the ability to be lighting fires for some time. Why can't you light that fire? Can you light this fire? Okay, for some reason, suddenly he can't actually light the fire. Even though he's been lighting fires that have been out for some time at this point, but screw it, apparently suddenly he can't. Right, here we are. Right place and time. You bastard. Scalamandra lackeys. Hello there. Let's just chat to you. Where's your tribute? What tribute? I mean the kids, fool. Let me pass. No tribute, no entry. This is pointless. Yeah, you know what? Let's just kill all these guys. That's fine. What are we on at the moment? Oh, we're on the group thing. That's a-okay. And now just go on third attack combo. And keep going. Yeah, there we are. Just gets more and more powerful over time. Though these guys are definitely a bit better than some of the other guys we fought so far. So they're actually doing a decent job dodging. But we're doing some decent work to the guy behind him too. Right, let's just get out of here. Right, and you're almost dead, right? Yeah, you're almost dead, so let's just get you down for the time being. There we are. Now you, screw you, and now let's just go for a big... Oh! Art of the Heavy Blow is basically a kill. Right, I should definitely be doing that way more often. That's hilarious. And I guess we've got more going on down here. This will be where their little uh, thing is down in this direction. Unless, of course, I've just walked straight past it. But just No, I've just walked straight past it. There's just a cave down there. Not sure what the point of that cave is, but there's clearly a ritual of power here. Yep, place of power. Let's power up so the Ard is amazingly strong. Right, ritual of magic. Lovely. So yeah, it's actually one of these houses right here, which is odd because these feel oddly small unless they've got like a massive Skyrim basement or something. Now, we're also going to be taking on presumably what's like a bit of a boss or something in one of these. Let's just quickly double check here. I'm not sure I've got this one. Yeah, it's this one right here, I assume. I'm going to do one swallow right now. So just take that. 
and check which of these two houses it is. Samandra hideout. This one apparently. Right, okay. Just no, 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 no. Okay, just get out, the, get out of the way. Get out, of, everyone. No, jump out, jump out, jump out of the way. Jump out of the way and that just get them. Oh, bloody hell, you haven't got the thing set. Right, okay. Jump out of the way again. Okay, seriously. And right, one of you is dead and just finish him off. Ah, oh, like that. Lovely. Uh, right, we're actually a little bit on the injured side right now. Need to get one of you down, because quickly... Okay, this isn't going desperately well. Right, just get one of you out of the way here. And, oh, have you actually resisted that? No, you haven't. A stun and a hit is pretty much a done deal. Right, one, two, three. One, two, three. And now we're getting more into the hang of it here. Admittedly, this guy's not... Yeah, this guy's not so good. Right, now, go over to... Heavy, wait for that to come back. I need to wait for this to jump out the way. I know my vitality's low. He's quite tough. Right, okay, just, no, zap him. Zap him. Zap him. Why are you not zapping him? Right, and just zap him. And now kill him, please. Ah, did the job. Finish him off. Nope, job done. Whew. Right, yeah, force, push, and stab. That's pretty good. So, your debt just... Help myself to some more flipping amulets. Ah, but there's more here yet. As I suspected, we've got ourselves a trap door here. Now, what's going on down here? Those crates look familiar, like Heron's goods that I saved from the drowners. The son of a bitch is trading with Salamandra. Oh dear. Well, that's useful to know. Right, we'll definitely be turning him into the Reverend. Down to the cave, where presumably now we need to get. Okay, just prepare, prepare, Salamandra. Okay, you said the last guy was the Salamandra boss. It feels like there's more than one boss, which isn't how bosses work, but all right. Hello! Right. Oh, no, he wants to chat first. Okay. You took your time. You have something of mine. No longer, I'm afraid. And you, like your predecessor, you work for rapists and murderers. Enjoying it? Where's Berengar? That dolt ran off. But during our brief acquaintance, he was certainly more talkative than you. No wonder, given Azar Javid's persuasiveness. Uh, I've no idea who that is, so if you meant that to be a dramatic reveal, it didn't work. Who's Azar Javid? A powerful mage. You're no match for him. We'll see. Your courage isn't lacking, Witcherette. We'll see how you fare after Azar gets you. Did you say I work for murderers? That lice-ridden village hick Odo came to us for advice on how to kill a warrior. We said someone so pathetic could only fight soldiers in dreams. This is a scintillating conversation, but it's time for some action. We don't have what you seek. It's not here. They took it straight to our base in Vizima. Too bad. Let's dance. Okay, blimey. That's that's not what you should really do right now. Because we've just learned that of the three guys, who are the main three guys in the village, aside from the Reverend, one of them's trading with these guys, another one's a murderer, and, well, Mikkel was always a bit of an idiot. Fine. Let's just get out of here nice and quickly. Nice and quickly. Nice and quickly. Just, just, no, just get past. Get past. That's some nice dancing right there. Right, get my health back. Have we actually got set up now? Let's go over to the group thing, and... Boom, and... Okay, just go. Just go. Just... Just... Okay, go for someone. Actually, go for whoever the weakest one is, because then you'll get you'll get more chance of actually hitting. There we go. One of them's already flipping dead. Right, now go for this guy. Nice, and we've got plenty of health for the time being. Lovely. And he's going down. Admittedly, we're not doing much against you. Right. Just round to you. Actually, you're almost dead. Right. Scalamandra Lackey is down. You are... Just take you out and then finish you off, please. Job done. Nice. I like that force push. Oh, hello. What are you doing here? That was some neat sword work. Alvin, why are you here? The Reverend sent me to this deserted house. He said someone would be waiting there for me. That son of a... <clears throat> I'm glad you're safe. I overheard them saying we'd be taken to Vizima. To Vizima? That's where I need to go to find Salamandra. Follow me. We'll find a way out of this cave. That wall looks pretty thin. Maybe we can break it down. Let's try. We really don't need to. I just came down for a trap door that I assume has a ladder attached to it. Otherwise, how did these guys get in or out? But all right, fine, whatever. Let's just quickly help myself to all the money. Oh, yes. Coffers. I like coffers. 
This will very much do. And a silver ruby ring. And some blueberries. Booze. Book of the Tawny Owl. Which contains... Ooh! Formula for potions! Wait, hang on. Is this actually what was stolen? Ooh, yes. Oh, maybe a part of it anyway. Right, we'll definitely take that. And also take myself a torch. So now I've got myself a torch in place of a dagger because a torch is a lot more useful. Right, and also there's there's just a floating skull, but whatever. Yep, just learnt a whole bunch of new formulas there. Very, very nice indeed. And also there's more children over here. Right, well, I guess you just want me to blow up the wall rather than doing anything else then. Okay. Boom, I can do that. Through here, everyone after me, please. Can't help but notice. Hello, Abigail. Abigail, are you down in a cave with children and a cauldron? Because I don't mean to cast aspersions on your good nature, but this doesn't look good. Like, we did this in Dishonored 1 when there was a witch and a cauldron and captives, and in general it doesn't... Okay, fine, Abigail, you're going to let me down here. Why did you come here, Witcher? Why are you here, witch? I'm brewing up another spell. Why? Lots of smoke in your magic. Mighty ingredients make mighty spells. Mighty enough for the whole village. Why are you doing this? The angry mob has come. Burn the witch, they cry. She has summoned the beast. I must defend myself. Men summoned the beast with their wicked deeds. I'm not surprised. Honest Mikkel violated Ilsa. She took her own life. You profited from the poison. Odo killed his brother for coin. The Reverend exiled his daughter when she became pregnant. Now she whores herself in Vizima. Heron sold a squirrel to the guards for gold. You knew, but did nothing. They trade their gold for poisons and other potions. No business of mine how they're used. It's clear why the beast haunts you. I need to expose the guilty. Stay here while I speak to those outside. Don't let them harm me. My sins are not as great as they say. Really? Learn for yourself if you like. We're alone. We have some time. Oh, oh, hello. Yes! Yes! Finally! We finally get... Wait, hang on. How's that going to help me learn about your sins? Like, if anything, well, I guess if... If she's really boring and uninteresting at sex, then that means she's more pure according to some form of weird puritanical morality whereas if she's really kinky that suggests that she's her sins are just i don't know where she's going with that but all right fine let's do it right in the cave and hopefully the children aren't watching oh oh blimey wait what whoa 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 what where did that come from why is that whoa oh, oh. that wasn't that wasn't okay that why was that that was weird blood and Stuff! Did we just do it in one of her potions or something? Alright, well, at the bare minimum, I've finally had the chance to do it with someone in this game. Bloody finally! Good! Good, good, good. Well done. Also, I think I actually need to level up at your fireplace quickly. I suspect there might be a very big either fight or talk down coming. So let's just check if there's anything I can do here in terms of... Ah, when that's filled up, presumably I go over to... No, that can't be 15. I don't know. Maybe when that's full up, I'm close to going over to silver. I've no idea. Right. Let's see what we can do here. Don't want any of that. That doesn't allow me to kind of have any new speech checks. Fine. Let's just focus on strength here. Ah, yes. Just straight up more damage in the strong. Actually, I can like the group. The group is good. The group is nice. Or knock down. Oh, knock down plus 20%. Yes, fine. And then go over to strong because strong's good as well. Then I'll have crushing blow damage plus 20%. That's pretty good. And then one more. Ooh, damage plus 40%. Ah, but only when 15% vitality. No. Let's just go for bleeding plus 15%. So bleeding too. Nice. That'll do for me. Right now, they're all just standing outside. being like, that witch has been in there a long time. Should we maybe like, you know, go in after him? No, no, it's fine. It's fine. He just needs to rescue the children, kill all the Scamandra, and then also have sex with the witch, and then also meditate for an hour in order to improve himself. Although actually, yeah, if, if they were guilty in working with the Scamandra all along... Why send me against the Scamandra? Why not just say, oh, we don't know where they are. We've absolutely no idea. Why would they ever play along unless they were planning to, like, use me to kill the Scamandra and then hope I wouldn't, like, find out what they'd done? I I guess that sort of makes sense, or at least the closest thing to sense we've got. Hi there, guys! B burn the devil's m mistress! Let the bitch die in pain! The witch hides within. Let the eternal fire consume her sinful body, and we'll be rid of the beast. Not so fast. 
She must be judged fairly. That bitch ruined my life! She cast her spells on my brother, wanted to steal him and his gold. My brother scorned her, so she did the devil's magic on me, used me to kill him! The treachery! I came across a doll that resembled you in her hut. I dream of it even now, her magic committing the murder. She should die! And I've no choice but to believe you. No, I don't. Your brother was a warrior. We've seen the armor. That was his brother's armor, of course. So you're nothing but a drunk. How could you have killed him unless he was sleeping? Why listen to him, Reverend? He's a mutant, a freak, a, a witcher. What are your charges, Haran? She, she made me a hawker. She p p promised herself to me if I helped the Skoyatel. I detest non-humans, but I had to, to, to trade with them. You've done all right for yourself. G gold isn't everything. There are principles to abide by. Your charges are absolutely flipping appalling. You trade with bandits who kidnap children. I don't believe a word of what you're saying. Your argument's incredibly flimsy in general, actually. You trade with bandits who kidnap children. I don't believe one word of what you say. Have you made your decision? What do you think, Reverend? The witch used Odo and Haran. She poisoned Ilsa. And no, 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 no. I have it on good authority. The missy, I don't know this. This might be a lie, but in fact, actually, this is the one I've got almost no evidence for. But I have been told that Mikkel raped Ilsa, took her own life. I guess Abigail would know that Ilsa came to her asking for the poison and maybe would say why. But we don't really have much in the way of evidence to support that. But screw it, I'm going to side with Abigail. Mikkel raped Ilsa, who took her own life. Abigail should have departed long ago, but stayed to exact revenge for the evil fate that befell her. She used the devil's magic on these simple people and summoned the beast. Okay, you've not been listening to a word I've been saying, have you? No, 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 no. Shut up, you bastard. You lead this band of rogues. You must know they sell children to the salamanders. You know about the rape and the murder. I spit on you. Okay, it's pretty extreme in both directions. Either we're literally starting to spit on him and throwing all the accusations out, or I've decided that Abigail's guilty and we're going to put her to death. No, we're going to go with the you're all a bunch of bastards. I'm getting Abigail. Return to your homes. Since the beginning of time, woman has been the nest of all evil, the tool of chaos, party to the conspiracy against the world and the human race. Woman is ruled solely by corporal lust. To satisfy her insatiable hunger and unnatural desires, she gladly serves demons. They intend to kill us. Don't be afraid. Oh, I'd like to see them try. There she is! Burn the foul witch! No one is burning anyone. Friends, they wish to scare us. Fear not! They're helpless as long as we stand together! Is that so? Be gone, witcher, and leave the witch, or we'll burn you too. I'd like to see you try, pleb. Ha -ha! Shove off, and maybe I'll let you be. You have two options. Wait until I leave and then murder Abigail, but then I'll come back. I'll slay every lice-ridden peasant, anything that moves and can't climb a tree. Or you can try to lead honorable lives, clear your conscience, start again, like humans. The choice is yours. Thank you, Geralt. Let's go. We need to deal with the beast. I thought the beast was just a manifestation of them being dicks. They just need to stop being dicks. Or I guess we could just skip that part and literally defeat the beast by stabbing it in the face. That works too. And then everything was on fire. Oh, there's the beast. Yeah, we've run into you before. You're just a red dog. A red fire dog. Lovely. Let's kill him. Okay, we've got a few to take out in the meantime. Right, hang on. No, 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 no. Right, focus on these guys. Oh, I think she's buffing me, which is nice. Okay. Lovely, in fact. Right, are they, are they all dead? I think they're all... Most of them are dead. Right, just let's finish off all of the other guys and just... Go, go, go. Right, now, avoid, because I'm guessing he's got some powerful attacks on him. Just avoid him. You are down on the ground for the time being. Right, and then just avoid... Oh, are you healing me? Ah, you are doing some white maging on me, aren't you? Yes, fine. Right, now, go over to a different sword. Select my charge, and... Excuse me. No, you don't. Hit him. Hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him, 
Oh, that didn't work. It didn't stagger him at all. Right. And go. And also, I've got a... Wait, what, what, what's happening? Uh-oh. I've been affected by something. I've been affected by something. Right. Something's very bad here. I need to do a potion. I'm not apparently being affected by my healing right now. I need to do a quick swallow. And then just avoid. And then get out of that. Right. And... Go. No. That's not working. Okay, now there's several of them. Several of them. Go over to this. Go, go, go. And go, go, go. Right, go and finish off. Apparently, oh, that's the knockdown that I've just put on. It's really powerful, by the way. Right, finish that off too. Are you dead? Not quite. Ah, you are keeping me going, though. How's the beast doing? And just hit it with the... Hit it with the... Oh, he's got some form of, like, staggery ability on him. And it's very annoying to deal with. Right, and go. I think he's actually almost done. Right, hit him. Boom. And he's temporarily... Oh, yes. Oh, that force push. Oh, that force push. Oh, that... Oh, are you okay? Oh, she's not okay. Oh, no, she is okay. She's fine. She's fine. Helping that whore was your last mistake. Die, bloody mutant. I have enough strength for the two of you. Oh, no. Grab the pitchfork. There's, there's more than two. There's way more than two. Right, go over to this again. Right, hang on. Excuse me. No, 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 no. Excuse me. No, go for this guy. And go. No, go to C. Go to C. There we go. And now, oh, yeah. This is what we need to do. Right, Harren Brog needs to go down. And everyone else is being chopped down very quickly as well. I'm assuming she's alive somewhere. Is she okay? Hope she's okay. Oh, I don't see her anywhere. Oh, I think she might be a bit dead. Oh, I'm really sorry if so. Right, go over to this. One heavy blow. Job done. Is she dead now? She might be... Oh, I think she's still moving. I think she can't die. No, I think she's good. Right, let's just quickly loot this thing. What's the thing got on him? Silver amber ring. Ectoplasm. Trace of the beyond. Probably valuable. Right. And what about you? Do you have anything good on... Oh, she's still healing me. Nice. Ooh, 250. And that pass. Nice. We'll just take it off your bloody corpse. Geralt, what would have happened to me without your aid? I'm glad you found it in yourself to believe me. Who would I be otherwise? I chose lesser evil. Um, neither of those things really. Like, you know, me and you had sex. I was told this game had sex. I was really looking for someone to have sex with. Wanted to have sex with you from the beginning. Thank you. Farewell. Wait, what do you mean farewell? No! No, I want us to go on dates! Dates! We could watch things on DVD like Firefly! No, come back! Oh, okay. She she didn't want that to be as long-term a thing as I was hoping for. Oh, oh never mind. Now just find the important corpses, because the important corpses have got giant piles of money on them. There we are. So I've got like 100, 250, 120 there. So, uh, pretty sure I've got your lot. And with the beast dead, uh, hopefully, that means the annoying little wolves will stop spawning in. Possibly anyway. Also, there's just corpses everywhere now. I'm not sure why. Possibly like that big fire was supposed to have killed everyone. I think the entire village might be dead. Is literally everyone in the village dead? Is this the resolution that we went for in the end? That uh, now literally everyone but me and Abigail died. We were the only bloody survivors out of the entire village. Oh. oh I feel like that might not have been the good ending. I mean, technically, you know, I feel like Abigail was definitely being unfairly maligned, but... This solution has led to literally everyone being dead, which feels wrong in some ways. Also, apparently these dogs are still bloody showing up. And just indeed, there appears to be, um, literally no one left in the entire village, even during the day. So unfortunately, the village was so evil and full of evil people that the fire killed the vast majority of them. And the final few survivors who were over by the cave were killed directly by me. And the only survivor is that chicken. So that's good. That's that's definitely the good ending of this bit of The Witcher 1. And I've now got a pass as well. So now I assume I'm just allowed into the city. Be flipping beautiful. I just completely forgot I was supposed to go and find Shani first. Sorry. Yeah, there was the whole bit of business that I was supposed to go and speak to Shani. Because me and her... Oh, hang on. Maybe me and her can get together. We're into the sex bit of the game now. Maybe I can sex the Shani next. And that's good, because that means we can now increase the number of survivors to two. 
Abigail and Shani are both around. Now you may point out that of course the only two survivors of this massacre appear to be two buxom young ladies who Jarrett would like to sleep with. And that's true, but also, there's clearly someone else. Ooh, the Royal Huntsman apparently survived too. <laughs> don't, just don't go up to him. Just don't talk to the police right now, okay? I feel like enough people have died, we don't talk to the police anymore. Good news, Shani. Literally everyone's dead. Geralt, are you alright? I was so worried. I'm fine. I'll tell you what happened on the way to Vizima. I'm done with this village. So am I. I hope I never return. It's unfathomable how many criminals live here. Not anymore. Now literally none live here. So next up, find the city gate that Mikkel is guarding. I think he said he was about to change gates, so maybe it's the other one by the village. Ah, no, he's in the gate in the middle. Fine, okay, so I think we can just go... Actually, I think it won't make any difference either way. I didn't even know there was a third gate in the middle, but apparently that's the one he's on now. Oh, I shouldn't have come this way. This way, Shani has to walk past the giant pile of corpses. And she might ask questions as to how far I might just be slightly responsible for the giant pile of corpses. Which is, admittedly, about half of them directly, half of them indirectly. And I'm guessing that'll be the Miller's Gate over there, up that there ramp. That's nice, even in a fancy medieval setting, they've kept Vizima wheelchair accessible. Vizima lies beyond this gate. I hope we never return here. Me too. The beast is dead. The salamanders are dead. And the peasants. Hmm. I have a pass. Mikkel should let us enter. Let's go. And good news, Mikkel. I've got a pass, so you better bloody let me in. Mikkel, I need to enter the city. I have a pass. I wanted to say I was sorry. I apologize, Witcher. Apologize to Ilsa, Mikkel. Sergeant, that witcher's here. The one I told you about. Uh-oh. Who do we have here, Mickle? Is this the man we want? Yes, sir, Sergeant, sir. It's that filthy freak, the witcher. A blasphemer and a counterfeiter, do I guess well? Yes, he asked who's allowed into the city. Then came with that, uh, that letter of safe conduct from the Order. Well, if that's a knight of the Order, then I'm Princess Adder. Son of a bitch. Oh, do I now have to kill literally all of you too? Because I will. Oh no, I've decided I can't be bothered. Instead, I've just surrendered and been taken to the dungeons. And so ends Act 1 of The Witcher, and Act 2 begins with us inside Vizima, as we've been trying to get into all along, but sadly, in prison. Hey, let me out of here, I'm innocent. Those five pounds of fist tech were for personal use. Hey you, jailer, at least move me. I don't want to be with the politicals. Politics makes you rot. I'm a decent thief. Let me out. Whoever that guy is, I like that guy. Stop screaming or on my mother's life I'll bloody smash your junky mouth. Absa fucking lootly beautiful. What's your problem, Whitey? You wanna dance to Vizeman? Come on, I wanna see your hands in the air. That's just Olaf in a different waistcoat. Jethro, open the cell. Ooh, scared. Soft as butter. Come on, Whitey, what you got? Back off. What, you want to fight or not? Professor, move it. You're free. Ooh, it's the professor. I'm not sure how the hell he's free. There's literally wanted posters up for him. How ironic, our paths cross again. So near and yet so far. Fear not, Witcher, we'll meet again. I assure you. You're making a mistake. This man's a murderer. You fail to grasp the basic rules governing this world. You're a genetically modified murderer with no place in modern society. But we'll tend to that problem next time. Farewell. I can't wait. And so we spawn 
Right here in this lovely, lovely cell. New location dungeon and new quest. I need to learn about the professor. You know what, ladies and gentlemen? I'm glad we did that one extra part because now we have indeed successfully completed the first chapter of The Witcher. Though sadly, we never actually got to make it down to the cave. But now that I know that there's like, you know, a big plot thing where you get captured, it does indeed now make sense that the cave would not actually successfully be a way I could get into the city. Because, well, unless I could skip this entire prison bit. If so, that'd be really, really bloody cool. But honestly, I think that's a bit much to ask. That what's clearly a big important plot point would be missed just because, you know, you were too clever for the game. So there we are. We are going to leave The Witcher off for now at least. But I'm going to be honest. Like, when everyone said, oh, just don't play The Witcher 1, just skip The Witcher 1, I thought, okay, you know what I'm going to do? I am going to play The Witcher 1, it's going to be a one-parter. Then I thought, okay, I'm quite enjoying this, I'll make this a three-parter. Then I got to the end of three parts, I thought, you know what, no, I want to extend this, because this is really quite good. <laughs> I will see how this series does. I will see how this series does, because if this goes well, and people are enjoying this, and the views are good, and people want to see more... I might consider The Witcher coming back, maybe in live stream format, maybe in an extended series, maybe returning at the end of like, you know, one of my current series. I genuinely don't know, but I've actually had a well of time with this. I've really enjoyed this, which actually in some ways makes me more interested in playing Witcher 2 and 3, because people say, oh, Witcher 2 and 3 are so, so much better. Well, we'll see about that. We'll, we'll have to see about that. Different people like different things, so... Maybe I won't like The Witcher 2 as much. We'll have to flipping see at some point. Still, I think we can most definitely say this is not the last you will see of The Witcher in some capacity on this channel. This will be back, or The Witcher 2 will be back, or The Witcher 3 will be back inevitably at some point. I've really just had a lovely time playing this. It's been an utter, utter delight. So, expect to see the franchise back at some point in the future. But in the meantime, I've been John. This has been many a true nerd. And this has been The Witch. And I've had an absolutely flipping lovely time playing this. Thank you very much, and goodbye. No, sadly, I cannot be the Santa Claus of murder tonight. So apparently, even though this thing is... Oh, no, no, you can't. No, you most certainly can't. Okay. Is that the symbol meaning I'm about to pull her over? Yep, there we are. There we... Oh! I feel like she didn't necessarily survive that. No, she's very dead.